Hey, brothers and sisters. Okay, guess what? I got just revelation just now. The Lord last night gave me a lot of dreams, it seems like. And it was all revelation, like literally revelation in the Bible. And it was all in sequence because you know what? The first dream that I had last night, I'm about to tell you now. And it was a dream that I was waiting in a line to enter a place. And when we were all excited to enter this place, there was going to be wine served here. And and I, w I got into a conversation with this woman, and um, she asked me if I was going to drink the wine. And I'm like, oh, I can't drink, you know. I, I Alcohol and me just don't get along. It's just, I, I, I can't, I refuse to drink. <laughs> and then she's like, oh, finally, someone like me. You know, she, she's, she's like, I've been clean for seven years. I was like, praise God, that's awesome. And so we're all waiting in the line, and there's many people who are getting discouraged. They're getting impatient. They are, they're bickering, you know, like, and so they left the line they turned away and so I'm being that encourager and I'm telling people to just hold on you know to not to not leave it's gonna open soon you know it's gonna come sooner than you think you know uh, just 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 be patient you know to just be patient like stay in God's presence and he'll give you patience he'll give you that peace you know don't leave and I'm telling people this and more and more people leave so the line gets shorter and we all move closer to the front and then the gate opens the gate opens and everybody cheers everybody's clapping and cheering and they're so excited and ready to celebrate and there was this girl in my dream who named was Samantha the name of Samantha in Hebrew means Listen, name of God. And so I knew that the Lord was showing me something. So I want to read to you Matthew 24, 9 to 14. Then you will be arrested, persecuted, and killed. You will be hated all over the world because you are my followers. And many will turn away from me, betray, and hate each other. And many false prophets will appear and deceive many people. Sin will be rampant everywhere, and the love of many will go cold. But the one who endures to the end will be saved. And the good news about the kingdom will be preached throughout the whole world so that all nations will hear it and then the end will come and God also gave me another scripture in Matthew 24 22 but it will be shortened for the sake of God's chosen ones talking about the days and then also this is amazing Revelation 3 7 12. Write this letter to the angel of the church in Philadelphia. This is the message from the one who is holy and true, the one who has the key of David. What he opens, no one can close, and what he closes, no one can open. I know all the things you do, and I have opened a door for you that no one can close. You have little strength, yet you obeyed my word and did not deny me. Look, I will force those who belong to Satan's synagogue, those liars who say they're Jews but they're not, to come bow down at your feet. They will acknowledge that you are the ones I love. And because you have obeyed my commands to persevere, I will protect you from the great time of testing that will come upon the whole world to test those who belong to this world. I am coming soon. Hold on to what you have so no one will take your crown. All who are victorious will become pillars in the temple of my God, 
and they will never have to leave it and I will write on them the name of my God and they will be citizens in the city of my God the new Jerusalem that comes down from the heaven from my God and I will write on them my new name brothers and sisters that that name Samantha listener name of God like and then Revelation 3.12 says, And I will write on them the name of my God. Woo! <laughs> oh, that's awesome. So, anyway, I wanted to share that with you. Um, also, when I entered the gate, when I entered the place, there was a room of nothing but telephones like a round circle table of nothing but all these telephones and different lines and connections so you know I believe that's all it's you know we're all going to be in one accord in heaven we're all going to be connected so I think that's what that is uh, symbolic of but um awesome praise Jesus so I love you guys God bless you and God is so good I He's awesome. I love you all. Bye.